truck varies from project to project. On this one, we had to do a gas main. We had a large infrastructure of electric to do. We built new uh, electric boxes and put in a lot of electric dock. Uh, the water, you know, the water, like we said already, was relatively new, and they changed a, a bunch of the gas services. The uh, road base down below the cobblestone is eight inches, and then we put in like uh, a, a uh, one inch, inch and a half, even up to two inch mortar base between the, between the uh, road base yeah, and the uh, actual stones. Generally, four guys put in the stone, and uh, one guy supplying them with mortar, and then the machine supply the stones and the sand. We lay down roughly in a, you know eight hour period, which you have to consider you know uh, lunch break, yeah. coffee break. And also the time to fit grout it, you know, we put down about 500 square foot a day. To the ground, we gotta follow uh, follow the middle middle of the street, and we strain we put the string line from uh, top of the curb to top of the curb, and then if the crown is seven inches, if the reveal is seven inches, we leave a top of the curb to top of the curb. If the reveal on the curb is like six inches, we lower up the crown in the middle like one inch, to be exactly, and then we follow. We put the string line from the middle to the curb, to the side, and then we just follow the line. In order to cut a stone, the way we do it is uh, we grab like a 35 uh, pound uh, lob hammer, we break it, try to hit it like like in the middle of the, the cobblestone so you can use both pieces so you don't waste the stone. First process of the mixing is uh, to put 25 shovels of sand and then we put uh, a box of cement, it's 94 pounds. And we mix it with a, a little water to get some some little webs to the first base, and we put the copper stones on top. We grow the joints, we gotta use a regular mix, a little strong, and then we use a broom to brush them up like that the cement goes inside the joint. Like the halfway, and we wear them up, and we go to halfway again on top. take a lot of pride in it and of course the cobblestone unlike the electric and the manhole and the sewer you don't see that stuff but yeah. at least we're able to see the uh, you know the finished product on the cobblestone And then we just spray a little bit of water on top to clean the stones and get the cement a little wet. And the cement has got to be set real good to those copper stones that doesn't move with the traffic passing top.
At the end of the day, we got it uh, clean all the tools and the mixing machine, that's the more important tools that we had there because it is working since 7 on the morning to 3.30. And we just go home happy and get ready for the next day of work.